Hello, fourth and fifth graders. I'm Mr. Adams again, and this is going to be for our last week of videos, week eight. We're going to be performing one song today called Samba La Le from a country called Brazil. Now, the goal is to be able to perform it. Now, fifth graders, if you happen to have ukulele, I know not everybody does. I bet very few do, but I'll be showing you how to play that on your ukulele. Um, and if you don't have a ukulele, you could always choose two different drums or two, two different instruments today. There's going to be a green part and a red part. Samba la le sounds like this. Samba, samba, samba la le le. Samba, samba, samba la le le. Samba, samba, samba la le le. Samba, samba, samba. That's it. So it says samba la le. Samba la le. Now the story is samba la le is actually a name of a mischievous or a boy who is sometimes gets in trouble. Um, he would sometimes pull pranks on other people. Samba Lele uh, usually got caught. And he, in Brazil, Samba Lele would be used to uh, help teach lessons to people. Like uh, the story about like the boy who cried wolf. Um, things like that. That would be similar to the stories from Samba Lele. Um, so, Samba Lele is very popular in Brazil. Lots of stories and lessons and songs about the boy. And this one is just a song about his name. It's usually taught very young uh, in Brazil. And then uh, when they get older, they start learning some other songs to go with his name. Samba, Samba, Samba Lele. Samba, Samba, Samba Lele. Samba, Samba, Samba Lele. Samba, Samba, Samba. Now, if you do happen to have a ukulele, now there are going to be three chords. First one is G, third string, or excuse me, third finger, bottom string in the third space or in the third fret. That's G. G happens at the beginning and at the end. And then there's going to be C. Remember, C is first finger, first fret, second string, and up top is the second finger, in the second fret. So this is C. So it goes C, 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 F, or I did that wrong. <laughs> Excuse me. G, 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 C, 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 C. Now fifth grade, the last chord, the D, this is the one that we learned at the very, very end of the third chord that was kind of tricky and it had three fingers. It's the one with a triangle. Start with your first finger. Second to top string, second space, then your other finger, your second finger, it's, they go in the same space, but it's on the bottom string. So both of those should be in the same space. This is the one where the, most of the kids were starting to make the mistakes because they couldn't get them in the same space. It helps if your thumb isn't pointed all the way to the top, and your third finger goes in the third fret, third space, on the second string. So you kind of make a triangle. So if you want to try it really slow, I'm going to go like this, and I'll do a pause in between each switch. It goes, samba, samba. Just play it twice. Samba, samba. Rest. We're going to switch to C. Here we go. Samba, la, la, la. Go to D, the three. Here we go. Samba, samba. Go to the new chord, uh, or back to the old chord of G. Samba, la, la, la. Then the second time you stay on G. Samba, samba. Pause. Go to C. Samba, la, la, la. Go to D. Here we go. Samba, samba. Then go back to G. Sam. Now I'll do the whole song without the pauses, so if you want to practice this, you can. Samba, 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 la, le, le. Samba, 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 la, le, le. Samba, samba. See, samba, la, le, le. Samba, samba. And then end on song. 
Now, for those of you who don't have a ukulele, I'll be teaching you the green and red part. You need your two instruments. I will be using a cowbell and a hand drum. Now, the green part is going to be pretty easy. The goal is to be able to play both of these, but I'm going to teach it to you one part at a time. So this is just two, two, rest, rest. Here we go. Samba, 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 la la la. Samba, 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 la la la. Samba, 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 la la la. Samba, samba, sam. So that should be really easy. Okay, it goes so half note, half note, rest, rest. Two, two, rest, rest. The drum part is actually a fifth grade rhythm. This is a tom T. So it goes um, rest, 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 tom T2. Rest, 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 tom T2. Tom T2. Now remember, this uh, is a whole rest. It's for all four counts. So it goes samba, 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 la la la. Samba, 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 la la la. Samba, 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 la la la. Samba, samba, samba. The last one on psalm, you do play a tom T2 still. All right, now what we're going to try is we're going to try playing both. We're going to be doing the cowbell, more cowbell, and the drum. So it's going to go like this. Here we go. Samba, 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 la la la. Samba, 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 la la la. Samba, 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 la la la. Samba, samba, samba. Hey, could you do both? Here we go. Samba, 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 la la la. Samba, 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 la la la. Samba, 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 la la la. Samba, samba, samba. Did you get it? That one wasn't too bad today. So what I want you to do is have an awesome summer. If you ever want to email me or send me some messages, you can always email me at andrew.adams at hpstigers.org. That is for my school email, and I'll try to respond if anybody has questions, or if some of y'all want some uh, ukulele practice or recorder things, just go ahead and shoot me an email, and I'll give you as many materials as you want. All right, thank you very much for an awesome school year. I hope that you guys have had a good fourth quarter.